Hello everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to create columns in a Microsoft Word document. So I have a Word document here. It has a title. It has some text. It's about a page and a half. And I want to create two columns with a space in the middle on this Word document. So to do that, I'm going to click on the Layout tab here. Now this is the Columns tab in Page Setup. I'm going to click on the drop down menu. There are some presets here. There's one, two, three left and right. So I'm going to click on two. When I select that, it creates two columns. But it also included my title in the column. And I don't want the title on the column here. I just want my title up on top of the page across. So I'm going to click on do. And you can also use the shortcut on the keyboard, Control Z to undo. So I'm going to put the cursor at the beginning of the first paragraph. I placed it in front of the M. I'll click on the columns tab again with the drop down menu. Scroll down, click on more columns, and this dialog box pops up. Now these are the presets here. So I'm going to click two. And as you can see, number of columns, I can change it here also, or I can click the presets. And notice this is the preview. This is how it will look on the preview. So I'm going to leave the width and spacing at the default setting. Now this is the equal column width. I'm going to leave that checked because I want the columns to be equal. Now when apply to it says whole document. I'm going to click on the drop down tab here and I'm going to select this point forward. And this is how it shows on the preview. I'm going to click OK. And it created the two columns with the title on top. Now I have this paragraph here and I want this paragraph here so that it will look better on the document. So to move this paragraph from here to the right side, I have to place the cursor at the beginning of the paragraph here. Click on the breaks tab. Now I do not want a page break, but what I want is a column break. So I have to select column. And this creates a column break here. So this is how it looks. And it looks much better. Now I'll click the columns tab again. Select more columns. Now this is a line between. So if I want a line between the two columns, I'll check this and I will click OK. So this is how it looks with the line between the columns. I'm going to click the undo here. Click on the columns, scroll down to more columns. On the width and spacing, I can also change the space between here. And this is where the changes are made. I can just highlight this, for example, and the spacing I can type 0 0.35 here. I'm going to leave it as equal. Click OK. And the space between changes. I'm going to click the undo. Click on the columns tab. Scroll to more columns. I am going to leave it as default here. But you can make any kind of changes you would like. So this is how you can create columns in a Microsoft Word document. So I hope this video was helpful to you. I thank you for watching. I ask you to subscribe.